pressure. Okay. <laughs> All right, man, we're going to uh, throw you into manual mode. Uh, I'll give you one little word of caution on this. Yep. See how close the paddles are to the wipers and stuff like yeah, that? Yeah, kind of easy to grab yeah, up there. Yeah, so literally all you need to do is, it's not like the Ferrari where you have to, you know, kind of reach for it. Yeah. It's right there it's right on here. the wheel. So okay. just, uh, it's probably kind of nice because I'm sure on the bike you're used to the clutch being yep. like right there. So just think of it that way. <laughs> okay. So, all right, man, let's roll. Only other thing I'll say on this car too, it's rear engine, right? Yep. So you will feel that weight move around in the back a little bit. Okay. So, you know, just keep that in mind. If you feel the back end getting loose on corner entry, that's a good indication you as a driver, you might be turning the wheel too aggressively into the corner. Okay. So, Cause you've got, you know, it can act like a pendulum a little bit. So just yeah. keep that in mind. And then, but this car, I mean, has so much grip. It's amazing. Yeah, you're, you're good. Yeah, we're good. All right, shift points are pretty much the same. So third gear up here. Go, get that brake balance going. Brakes a little, not quite sensitive. It'll take you a lap to yeah, get them up to ten, feel them out, yeah, for sure. There you go. And this car you can brake a little later than the okay. F12 as well.
on the exit there. Okay. Yeah, I know you're coming up on him, but the car definitely could have took more. Okay. Just so you know. <laughs> yep. Right side. Right knee. Yeah, perfect. session for the day. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, that's awesome, man. Yeah, that was awesome. fun. So you gonna get one of these or what? It's a pretty nice car, isn't it? Yeah. Not, a track day toy? Not not a, an RS. I'm not that big of a baller. Maybe a normal GT3. I will say this. Here, we'll take it to the right. Okay, the normal GT3, right over here, yeah. And then we're gonna park it between the GT3s and the Z06 over there. Okay. We'll say this, so the new GT3 just came out. It was just announced at Geneva. You can get it in both a manual or a PDK, your yeah. choice. Um, and it actually lapped uh, their test track two tenths of a second quicker than this fit. Just the really? Just, just the, the standard GT3. GT3? Yeah. The problem is there's such a big waiting list for them that's hard to get, but yeah, you could probably uh, you know pull some strings and you could probably get a car if you really wanted one. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yeah, no, it's... It's sick, man. It's I mean, sick. It's, and plus, it's got a four liter. Uh, it's got the four liter flat six from the cup car. So this is the 9A1 platform, which it's a four liter, 500 horsepower, just like the new one is. However, the new one is actually directly out of the GT3 cup car. So it's a race engine. Yeah. And everyone 